Hey YouTube, um, well, I decided to make this video, it's a little late at night, so I'm sorry if I seem a little tired, um, it's like 10.30, which isn't normally late for me, but, um, it's been a very long week, so, um, very little school, with all the finals and everything, very little sleep, look at this, I'm already not talking very well, <laughs> but anyways, um, as you can tell, I'm pretty excited, pretty stoked, because um, today uh, I've been working on my two rooms. So let me show you this. So first of all, this is my bedroom. And as you can see, my computer is now in here with uh, both my monitors, um, Stormtroopers back and everything. So it's looking pretty cool. Um, which I'm very happy about this and it turned out fantastic but this is not what I'm really stoked about I'm stoked about my studio now that that is out of my studio it has really opened up the space in here as you can see I mean it is a ginormous space or at least plenty big enough uh, to actually have a band in here, which that's the goal, is to end up um, getting a band and being able to practice in here. So let me go ahead and show you around real quick of uh, what exactly is going on. So first of all, here's my guitars for those of you who haven't seen it. I've got an awesome Epiphone Les Paul uh, Epiphone bass, which honestly is pretty bad. I do not recommend that guitar, but there'll be more videos on this later on. Uh, Gibson SGJ. Uh, I think it's a 2014. 2014, I believe. Yeah. Um, and then my signature Ibanez guitar, which is fantastic. It has some awesome DiMarzio pickups in it. Fantastic. But enough of that. Um, uh, let me just kind of show you briefly, because again, like I said, I'm going to actually do videos talking about all this stuff in more detail. There's my Marshall. Um, it's a 40 watt uh, DSL 40C. I highly recommend this amp. It's fantastic. If you're looking for a um, combo amp that gets you a lot of power and can actually uh, compete with drums, uh, live drums, and actually perform on stage with this, it's fantastic. It's not as good. Like some people have said that it is just as good as a full Marshall stack, which is untrue, unfortunately. However, for this size of a room, it works absolutely superb. I can record on this. It sounds great. Um, also have, let me go show, go ahead and show you this other amp is my orange. Um, this is actually used and I got this at a really, really cheap price. I think it was like 30 bucks and uh, I think it's a 10 or 15 watt. I'm not really sure on that one, uh, so don't quote me on it, but it's pretty cool. Um, also got a nice Yamaha uh, electric keyboard, electric piano. It's not a keyboard. Um, I keep wanting to call it a keyboard, but it's not. I've had this for many years, probably about mm, seven or eight years. Yeah, I've played piano a lot longer than guitar, but I suck at piano, and I am pretty good at guitar, at least decent on the guitar. Um, so yeah, it's fantastic. Um, let me just kind of show you what the vision for this room is real quick. So over there where my acoustic is, which I forgot to show you it, it's a Yamaha. Fantastic. Highly recommend Yamahas. They're really cheap. I mean, that was $300, but that came with all the electronic equipment and everything. Great guitar. Great, great, great guitar. But actually over there, the acoustic's not going to stay there. That's going to be where the drum kit is going to be. I don't know when that's going to happen, probably not for another year. I won't be able to get drums because I want to focus on getting all my guitar stuff right and good before I start working on that. But, um, yeah, I'm really, uh, really stoked about getting a drum set in here. That would be awesome. And over here where Iron Man is, which if you haven't seen Iron Man, this is my Iron Man suit. Again, <laughs> there's going to be tons of videos on him. But uh, just a brief overview of what Iron Man is, is that's a full suit Iron Man, or 
Iron Man suit, duh. <laughs> and you can actually get inside of it. Um, it's actually a costume uh, built for me. I built it myself. Uh, this is actually the second one I made, and it's very good. Um, it's not perfect, but um, the few details that aren't 100% accurate are really, really close. But anyways, where Iron Man's going to be, that's where a uh, vocal booth is going to be. And when I say vocal booth, it's not an actual booth. Um, that Where Iron Man's standing is where the singer will be. But I'm going to get one of those foam um, like uh, microphone covers and... That's what I'm going to use that for, and uh, so that area is pretty sound tight, if that makes sense, so that uh, vocalists can sing live with drums and uh, guitar. Uh, now there's some other things I need to get, which I will talk about in future videos. Um, my room's still a little messy around the edges, but I hope you don't mind that. But anyways, oh, I got the flashy red light warning me that I'm about out of battery. So I'll just end it here. Um, I just wanted to get this video posted. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this. There's going to be a lot more to gum. I am back on YouTube with a brand new channel and hopefully I stick with it for a lot longer. Anyways, it's a New Year's resolution that I'm getting started a little early on. Anyways, uh, peace out everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. If so, leave a like. It really helps out the channel. And go ahead and click subscribe. Um, so, see you guys in the next video. Peace out everybody.